Mr. Beagley. Hey there guys and gals, it's Grabeagly with another episode of Gaming with Grabeagly and I'm once again playing another random one shot from over here on lag.com. This is a game called Bus Parking 3D and in this we are a bus driver who has to park our bus safely. Now I know what you're thinking, you're thinking Brian how can this game actually be exciting? I don't know, I mean to me it's already exciting because normally I drive a regular sized car in this game I get to control something a little bit bigger and maybe if I'm bad at it at least the mayhem will be entertaining but hopefully I'm not going to be bad at it hopefully I'm going to get all the coins that are on the course and it looks like we can unlock more buses so we start off with this kind of bus we start off with 300 coins it looks like so I can afford to buy more buses Ooh, like a double decker uh, it looks like a city bus um, oh, that's like a, one of those like British double decker like tour buses. We don't have enough for that, so that's 500. School bus, uh, another double decker style bus, another double decker like old school double decker style bus. Um, I don't know what the heck that is, some crazy Candyland one. And then a majestic bus, something that costs 1,800 coins. My word. So we do have enough to buy this one and this one right off the bat. I might as well use the city bus then. We got it right in the beginning here so let's go ahead let's hit play and it looks like there are a lot of levels oh my god way more levels than i thought so i'm assuming these get progressively more complicated oh my guys there's like there's a hundred levels in this game there are a hundred levels in bus parking 3d so there's there's a lot of stuff we got to do here let's start off at humble little level one see how it goes for us okay oh my god that is not my favorite noise uh, that made it sound like it was like something awful was happening. Okay, so we can use the arrow keys or it looks like maybe WASD as well to move. All right, we're going. We're not moving very fast because we're a bus, but we're getting the coins. Oh, yeah. All right. So wait, do we have 10? Does this say we have 10 minutes to get our bus into the parking space? I mean, you got uh, uh, no judgment here if you're the type of gamer that needs that whole amount of time. But if you are, if you need 10 minutes to park your bus on a level like that, I don't know, maybe maybe get some more practice in, in some other games. Okay, so slowing me down, telling me to hit the left arrow to move around the corner here. Okay, just easy does it. Don't want to upset any of my passengers. Want to make sure that I'm making pretty good tips that they're, you know, going to leave me, make sure that they're going to pay their bus fare as well as, you know, maybe, maybe slip me a little extra bit, some change something like that oh easy peasy again there's a hundred levels so these are just the first two so far i have a feeling this game gets crazy crazy complicated just based on the fact that this is like this weird obstacle course type thing this doesn't seem like i'm actually like driving any passengers i feel like i'm like training right now and this time it doesn't give me the arrow prompt so i have to do it all on my own following the arrows here oh my god my speed's going into the red. I don't know what that means. Am I, am I too fast? This this is the fastest bus that's ever existed. All right, and slow down. Oh, yes. And it says urban on the back of our bus, I just realized. So we're the urban transport. So at first, I thought that it was going to take a long time to save up for more buses, honestly. But uh, also, I don't, I, I, I don't think that's the case. I think that uh, with how many coins we're getting per level and how fast it's being done... We're going to be able to get, like, you know, up to the the 500 or whatever pretty quick. Now, this is showing me. I have to... So, I have to park this in reverse. That's what that little flashing icon in the upper right is. Okay. And this makes... Okay. This is what makes it harder. Because I can't see behind me when I'm backing up here. So, this already... All right. That is a little bit more complicated. That's going to make things a lot harder. Trying to back up my bus. So, I... Okay. Okay. All right. Again, it gives us 10 full minutes to do these things. So, we're... We're learning, we're learning, but it doesn't mean that it's gonna be easy. It doesn't, just because we get the full 10 minutes, doesn't mean we're always gonna be able to do things in 10 minutes. I also like that our bus has like a health bar. I'm assuming the more objects I hit, the obstacles, the less health we have. All right, we already, we already spent like 20 seconds on this one because I'm already in the nines. I'm in nine minutes territory, but that's okay because I'd rather, again, get my passengers somewhere safe than upset anybody. Oh, yeah. That one I came in a little bit hot on, but it still counted it as parking it pretty well. So I'll take that. Oh, my God. Only level six. Level six. But that's okay. 
We're gonna get through as many levels as we can. Oh, this one only gave me a minute. Oh my gosh. Okay, so those were all just basically training courses, I'm guessing. Okay, so this is where the real game starts. Level six is where the real game starts. And, and I have to be more careful, but also I'm actually racing the clock. So that's why it gave me 10 minutes was those were the training courses basically being like, hey, you can take as much time as you need to get these done. Just know that it, we're gonna throw you in the deep end after that because oh my God, we have less than 30 seconds. How are we ever gonna do this? Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Okay, there it is. Fortunately, it's right there. But that took us most of our time. We're coming in here a little bit late, I won't lie. Okay, that was a lot more nerve wracking. It paid out with a lot more coins, so it's, it is gonna be a lot easier to save up for more of these bus types, these unlockable buses. It'd be kind of cool if they all like perform differently. I have no idea if they do. I doubt that they do, but they might. Who knows? Who am I to say? But uh, man, I'm I'm actually gonna get a little bit uh, nervous here if, if the game gives me a very short amount of time to do stuff in. I don't like time limits as is, but I was okay. I was like, yeah, 10 minutes for every single stage. I'll take that every time. This one, okay, a little bit easier than the last one in my opinion because it gave me more time. Give me way more time to park my bus. And the obstacles seemed like they weren't as tightly packed together. I guess six is where it separates, you know, it separates the future pro bus drivers from the amateurs because it gives you only one minute and there were like the crazy close together things. So like the elite of the elite get through level six and then seven sort of like a breather. And then you hit level eight again, which this is again, less than a minute they give you on the clock. And it's, I won't lie, this is, uh, oh my gosh. All right, that was some windy stuff. At least the goal wasn't very far away from the start. So we're in there, parked up good. It only took us 30 seconds to do that, but it felt like a million years with how nervous I was getting. Oh my gosh. All right, this one, I have to back up my bus first? No, I don't, okay. I thought that it showed me that I had to do it first. Fortunately, we just get to pull out. Got about a minute and a half to do stuff in, but we're gonna have to back our bus in. All right, this is a much more complicated job than it looks like right off the bat, I have to say. Props to bus drivers because this is very difficult if this is like what your training courses are like holy cow holy moly all right so urban bus just back on in there nice and slow okay good good stuff oh boy guys a lot more complicated than it looks i definitely challenge all of you watching right now to give this game a shot because uh some of these courses are wild all right we got only about a minute to do this one and it looks like it's gonna be the steepest angled turn that we will ever have had to do in this game. How do you do this one? I'm gonna have to like K-turn. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to K-turn it. There's a, that, there's not enough of a, a, a turning radius on my, my bus to have been able to make that without doing a K-turn there. That was wild. That's crazy and we're already, oh boy. We're running out of time. Okay, get on it up there now driving a bus this big and having the camera behind it the way that it is it's very hard to see like the depth perception wise where the front on my bus is so i'm getting a little bit nervous on turns like that that i'm going to hit some of those road cones that i'm assuming are going to do damage and like take points off or whatever that are surrounding the parking spaces because i don't really know how far up the front of my bus is it's kind of hard to tell fortunately so far we've been able to get every coin Oh my God, hurt, hit the curb a little bit, but that's okay. It doesn't look like it does any damage. That, what? Oh, we must not be straight enough there. That one got scary. I was like, oh my God, I'm, I'm gonna have to back all the way out again. And we only had seven seconds left there at the end. That was scary. Okay. Again, hats off to bus drivers. This is a lot more complicated than I thought it was going to be. All right, we only got 40 seconds and we're gonna have to back our bus in. Are you kidding me? And getting all the way across the parking lot here to do it. Got a SWAT van there in the parking lot it wants me to it wants me to start backing up all the way from back here this is gonna be nuts oh oh i took some damage oh no bus riders are unhappy with me okay that's okay just straighten it out stop panicking here oh my god we got 10 seconds 10 seconds oh my gosh all right night finish with 94 health on that one that one was crazy. Okay, this game is great though. This game is really, really fun. I like this one a lot. So we got through the first 12 levels 
unlocked up to level 13 but i think that's all the time i have today to play this game still pretty short from the 500 coins we're only at 169 but that's okay i'm still getting the hang of things it's the type of game that i can definitely go in and enjoy myself with and also give myself a little bit of a challenge but definitely give this game a shot guys this one was a lot of fun much harder than it looks and hopefully you guys had fun watching me struggle with this game if you did please 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 check it out over here on lag.com and as always it was great seeing you bye, -bye.